Hi, Melody here. You might know me as Apple Pie Movement. I am a humanitarian, sharing the conversations with humanity which need to be heard. In today's conversation with the founder of Blue Bear Clothing, a former professional baseball player turned fashion designer, we discuss the concept of blue, building life undivided. So, come on, grab a piece of pie and join our conversation. Children's clothing line. One of the items that I would like to create is a curriculum for swing because I see that not only raising awareness and passing legislation will end racism and and homophobia and so forth, but I also see it as a need for educating children and going into schools and teaching the importance of, of seeing people as human beings and respecting every human being for who they are. Uh, I would I would love to somehow incorporate your your children's clothing line into the curriculum that one day will roll out into the school system. Yeah, that'd be excellent. I think I think anything for me that is really pushing change, um, you know, and, and pushing racial equality specifically for us, although uh, you know, equality overall is really what I'm after as well. It, it's one of the reasons why you founded this clothing line for your your children was there some instance that happened between uh, your children uh, that made you feel like you needed to take the stand not specifically with my children uh, and thankfully we haven't had that issue but you know as i as i just kind of take a take an, a view at the landscape of you know what the world is coming to what the world is like um it seems like you know the the conversation surrounding race um, becomes more and more prevalent. And, you know, um, typically it seems like, you know, a, a lot of, um, a lot of African-Americans catch the hard side of that, um, especially if they're not raised that way, because they don't, they don't visualize themselves as such. So my know, kids, for example, um, they don't see themselves as any different than anybody else, just as I did not when I was a kid. Um, and so I think it's important to really make sure that, you know, as they get older, that they're able to identify with people who are like them, who don't see them for the color of their skin, um, and who just see them for who they are. And so that's, that's really, really what I'm after. Do you have a, a, a message with your, your clothing line? Yeah, so ours is, ours is blue. It's B-L-U, which is, stands for Building Life Undivided. Um, our hashtag is always hashtag I'm blue too, which is I'm building life undivided too. Um, that way, you know, we want to have as many people join the movement of I'm Blue 2 as possible um, because, you know, obviously the more the merrier and the more that people are outspoken and we know where they stand, then it makes it easier to create equality. Why did you choose building life undivided as opposed to being against racism or against, you know, discrimination? Sure, that's a great question. So I actually, uh, I, my, my, my local church here in Cincinnati, um, started a racial reconciliation program called Undivided. And so, you know, I, I took part in that. Um, and it was very ironic. There was a day that I was, you know, I was getting cleaned up and literally just, it just dropped on me of um, blue, B-L-U, building life undivided. So, you know, I don't know if it was anything, you know, anything magical to it other than it just it literally just kind of dropped on me and i was like you know what we're gonna go with it um and and that's what it's all about i mean that's how blue bear spell but you know that's something that i really felt passionate about and really felt uh i wanted to have conveyed through my business i hope that you will choose to be blue too because cameron has a great brand it needs to be out there Thank you, Cameron, for joining us for another Apple Pie Table Talk, and I look forward to seeing you all next week. Have a great day. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Thank you. I appreciate it.